Uh, hello, today I want to show you uh, another fuel separator. It's a accidentally mixed uh, diesel petrol fuel separator. So here you can see the petrol production. This is a this is a diesel coming out diesel fraction so here's the unit itself it's a small one but it's a new type I didn't do anything like that it's more energy efficient it's 2.2 uh, uh, kilowatt, 2.4 kilowatts unit, 2.4 kilowatt unit, somewhere around that. Uh, quite productive. It's a production speed. You can see. I truly believe a voltage regulator needs to be installed as well, just to. Increase the speed a little bit, that doesn't matter. Uh, and we're processing fuel now at 167 degrees. So the processing should be done between 167, uh, 160 and 200 degrees. Uh, I can increase increase the supply of the mix. And temperature will drop though I truly believe this is the maximum that this unit is capable of so to uh, decrease the speed of production just a little bit uh, a voltage regulator needs to be used just to run it at low voltages decrease the heating ability of the elements is a unit and running quite fast also I would recommend uh, thermal control so if it would be some sort of thermal run run away because there's no fuel or something uh, all systems should be switched off automatically but I believe my customer would sort it out himself here we got pump in a tray so it's an old pump a dribbling little bits and I use tray to prevent some spillage is a mix and production speed is about uh, 20 liters an hour something like that quite fast is a separation of the petrol so it keeps the temperature just raising a little bit doesn't matter it's good look to it a little bit not not a problem so anyway is a unit Thank you very much. There's another one, but it's different. Anyway, talking about this one. Thanks a lot. Bye.